Hi everyone, I'm Ray Lynn and I'm going to show you our preschool and toddler books. So we have different metal and matches. We have monsters, imagine, adventure, and jungle animals. And these are really cute books where they start out with a fun little um, story about the creature, animal, person, whatever. And then you can flip the different pages to create your own fun little story um, and change the parts of the body. Then we also have the flippy floppy jungle animals and we also have ocean animals as well. So for this one, we're looking for the elephant and we change all the flaps over to see all these different animals until you hold them all down and now you found the elephant and you can see through the little holes um, their eyes and things from the previous creature. So fun for the kids. Then we also have All Better, and this book has been um, on back order for months, like almost immediately after it came out. So it's back in stock, and this is a favorite. Um, these little uh, static clean band-aids, um, you peel them off and you put them throughout the book. It comes with five, and if they lose the tackiness, get hair on them, you just rinse them off, let them dry, and then they're good to use again. So we have um, a little story about how somebody gets hurt, and you clean it, you kiss it, and then you put a bandage on it, and it's all better all the way through the end of the story where everybody has a bunch of bandages on them. Kids love that book. We have a ton of wipe clean books. So Get Ready for School has ABCs and 123s. Um, activity books has mazes and puzzles and connect the dots. And then we also have beginning pen control, which is um, teaching kids how to do different shapes and designs and, and holding the pens correctly. Alphabet picture book. This book is um, great for helping to teach the alphabet. They're nice, sturdy pages. They're what I call an in-between page. They're not paper, but they're um, not a huge board book. So they're nice, sturdy. They have these um, tabs that you can see here on the sides and huge pictures that cover um, majority of the page. So this is a, a fun book also. I wish we had this book when my son was learning how to talk. Um, listen and learn first English words. It comes with a bunch of different cards in this fun little pouch over here. And you insert the card and then you push go and it tells you what card it is. And then if you push the different pictures, Duck. it says what it is. Very first book of things to spot. So this is a very first spot book. Um, this is really good. Spotting helps the kids um, scan across the pages. It helps uh, develop their attention span. Also, it helps different um, connections in the brain and um, hand-eye coordination, all that good stuff. So we're looking for who's wearing a bow or who's wearing a hat. So fun little pictures for the kids to see. And there's not too much going on the page to distract them. Then we also have my first word Spanish and English. And again, these are those transition pages. They're not quite board books, but they're not um, paper books yet either. So they're nice and sturdy for kids and they cover different areas um, in, in your life. So in the home, out the home, um, you know, things that go counting, shapes, colors, numbers, all that fun stuff. This is our animal activity book. Um, so we're learning different letters and there's little activities to go with each letter uh, in the alphabet. So you can see. And then in the back, there's the whole alphabet. Our noisy books. These are some awesome books and we have so many in the series. The ones I'm showing you right now are Noisy Zoo, um, Noisy Noah's Art, Noisy Train, hugely popular, and um, Noisy Diggers. We also have pirates and monsters and jungle animals and uh, spooky house, all those fun things. And it's fun sound. It has um, really big pictures 
and a little bit of story going with it as well as these tabs on the top to help with turning the page. And then we have big book of big all kinds of things. We have tractors, we have trains, um, we have sea creatures, we have animals, we have bugs, we have monsters, all kinds. And the books open up so they get really, really super wide and they show all kinds of big whatever the subject is. And then we have our thousand things. Um, this one is to eat. We also have a thousand animals and thousand things that go. And this is going to be those transition type pages. And you can see all the different types of pastas here. Um, things that are in the pantry. We can see things. More pantry items. Um, fruits and vegetables. All different kinds. So helps to build uh, vocabulary in our young ones. All right, thank you.